talk about something a little, a little more, a little more serious. Um, okay. We're not going to get too political on this podcast, but um, any thoughts on the riots? I know this is a little late, but the George Floyd um, incident that was the uh, I don't want to say anniversary, but yeah, oh, it, 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 it was the one year anniversary yeah. a couple yeah. days ago. Yeah. I mean, like we mean like, like riots, like we talking like the well, it's just. I don't like, know. I think all, it's, I think it's still going on a little. Aftermath of all of them. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That. Well, now, just like most people, we believe pr- protesting is fine. Oh yeah. But I, mean, mm-hmm. no, I think every writing, person believes that the a billion dollars in in property damage. Let's be honest. That's ridiculous. I mean that. Yeah. That that's. Okay. I, I, oh I don't yeah. They're protesting for a good cause. He was unjustly killed, and I'm glad that um, his. Killer got justice um, when he when he, when he stood trial, but he, yeah, I mean, seeing that that much damage to mm-hmm. black owned businesses and, and well, it's just businesses. random. It's just random businesses, yeah. and I mean, they have lot, nothing to do with. A lot of people were like even like not even part of it, and they were just like there because they could get away with it. Because I mean, Jake yeah. Paul went to the <laughs> riots. Oh I remember and that stole and, and broke into that businesses. That was hilarious. I remember the one in Kansas <laughs> so City. I, remember, I watched a live stream. I think it was on Facebook of a dude like breaking into Foot Locker. On what's the street? You know what I'm talking about like about that bowling's downtown. It's on the plaza. Like, yeah, it's on the plaza, plaza basically. Yeah. And they were, they yeah. broke in. They just stole the shoes. Yeah, <laughs> like, unbelievable. Was weird. Well, place. I actually saw, I saw one of those cat uh, construction things. Oh no! Freaking like go into like crash the <laughs> glass of a store. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That that's. I mean, people are wild out there. I do think I do think a lot of the media attention like overblows it though. Like, do you think everything's they a do. riot? They even do. though they, uh, most of it I mean, look that's what's going to make the money so they're going to focus on it no matter what yeah they, they chose the Very best true. shot the best yeah, shots exactly, exactly yeah okay well it's the news fear yeah. you know and some people say the property damage isn't the issue here you have to look at the bigger picture it's about the movement I say if you got in a car crash and <laughs> the guy asks for your insurance or whatever they ask for do you come out of your car saying the car damage isn't the issue here you should be worried about my life you have to look about the bigger picture like, no, you still have to pay for the damage yeah. you caused. But, like, also you don't know who exactly is supporting the cause and who is just there to take advantage well, of a bunch yeah, of yeah. Cat, mass it's, gathering of people. Yeah. Right? I mean, I think yeah. there's both people that are, like, like angry, take it to another level, and then, like, destroying stuff. But, like, I mean, the protest themselves obviously has a good cause. Like, saying, I'm against inequality. Like, yeah. I don't know why anybody would, like, be against that. <laughs> <Opposed stuff. laughs> yeah. I, I did mean, see. I did see a video. Probably, there's a few people. I, out I there, saw so. a video on YouTube. Yeah, this yeah, guy yeah. went to the like most racist town in America. I saw that. Like dude. A it, town, something like that. Dude, those uh, like oh with a BLM you, sign. Yeah. And he did that. Yeah. And they were like they're like shouting the N word at him and all that. Yeah, like, it was that's extreme. crazy. And only one person came up and told How, him. It was, it, they, it, was, they it was a kid him. too. A kid, a right? kid came up and gave him a piece of paper that said. And honestly, I think our generations. I mean, I think just. I mean, things are social media. You think our generations what? I think our generations a lot. um better about this ridiculous stuff of mm. inequality and stuff. I, I think what, every you know. every younger generation has been I mean like you can yeah, that's, civil yeah. rights and that's stuff like that like that's all oh, student our, led stuff in yeah, relative like, to I mean everything the past two generations like some, well yeah I mean with social progression yeah it's definitely gotten better but um, yeah I mean we, it, there's definitely been correct progression for sure like it's it's, got, it's consistently gotten better yeah but there's still there's still I mean, moments where there's trend. still those. I think there will always be those couple of people out there. I mean, not I don't know how many, but and yeah, yeah. I don't know. Unless they f- like physically hurt you or something, I think you just gotta ignore it. Well, even yeah. then, I think just like, don't interact with if, them. If you like look at it like like historical wise, like like nearly every single like mass protest or like cause for like social justice has been led by like young people like of that generation like civil rights mm. women's rights um lgbtq rights like all that all that type of stuff it's all like historically has always been young people so i don't think it's something unique to our generation i think it's just the fact that we're the younger generation yeah i think that when people grow yeah. older they just become more complacent and they're they don't they're like i served my time and had yeah. used all my energy when i was younger but i mean exactly yeah. i mean yeah or they, they like people that are young like building their worldview versus somebody that's had a worldview for X amount of years that their life that's kind of set in stone so yeah I, mean, I think that's what it is yeah they're definitely wise by then they realize I might not be able to to change this yeah, by being true. involved so I'm just going to sit back and, and, and relax since I've I may be retired now and I can just relax in the rest of my life instead of that stressing is, over this that is true but it's weird to see that like 
compared to young people, like with like voting and like showing up to primaries and caucuses and stuff like that, like it's majority like those are like fifty or older. Like a sure. lot, of, a lot of young people aren't participating in like actual like direct political action. It's always like posting, old, yeah. posting an Instagram. Yeah, um... they're not actually doing anything. They're not going out to vote, or they're not going out to like support like an actual candidate. Like, I mean, Some think about that. that. Yeah. Like, if you look at those um, like debates and stuff like that, like most of the time the audience is like older people, like forties yeah. or older, fifties or older, stuff like that. Mm-hmm. I definitely do yeah. think older people. I mean, as you know, they, they still hold their political views and, and support them they may yeah. just, they may not take as much physical action such as like going, going to the riots and stuff yeah, like that yeah they're yeah. not they're not the ones out there like on the street <clears throat> yeah 